I'm still at the alpaca farm and I decided to get out my paints and I'm going to paint a juniper tree. I haven't decided which one I'm going to paint yet, but I'll uh, go out and take some more photographs and see what we come up with. But before that, I'm going to prepare, I'm going to do an acrylic painting. So I'm going to prepare the canvas board. It's going to be a nice day until about 11 o'clock this morning. Uh, it is 9.25 right now. The wind is supposed to kick up and go for the rest of the day. So I wanted to get this out of the way. But I can paint in my van and I have enough room in there, but it's more fun to paint outside. All right. Should have brought a trash can on here. I'll stick it in my pocket so it doesn't blow away. These, these paints have been riding around with me <laughs> for about six months now. I, this is the first time I've gotten them out, so I feel a little embarrassed that I haven't, haven't tried to do any painting, but I just didn't have the inspiration and, until I got here. Um, I think it's the juniper trees that did it. So, and I hope this is not too dried up. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be okay. This is um, black gesso made by Golden. Golden is my favorite acrylic. But I use others too. I use Liquitex and... Uh, uh, well, actually, that pretty much all I use is Golden and Liquitex. But I should have brought some paper towels out of here. Because I'm pretty sure I'm going to get this all over my hands. And all over the table already. Oh, it's okay. So, some of you may or may not know that I used to own an art gallery. Actually, I own two art galleries. I owned a fine art photography gallery in Knoxville, Tennessee back in 2005-2006. That was one of the businesses I tried to start. And recently, I owned a hotel building, a 102-year-old hotel building in Springer, New Mexico, and uh, renovated it and uh, opened an art gallery. I was married at the time, and uh, things just didn't work out between me and him, so uh, after he left, I had to close the gallery because I couldn't, uh, I couldn't maintain the building myself. It's just, it's too old of a building and it's too, it was 8,000 square feet. So it was just too much for one person. So I sold, I sold the hotel in September last year and I bought my van. And the rest is history. <laughs> so I'm just been, I've been waiting for the bugs, the flies, to start bothering me here, but so far they haven't. I haven't had to put my uh, my awning up at all. I mean my um, the bug screen. <laughs> And it's a pretty cool bug screen that has a, a magnetic uh, closure on the side so that when you want to go out, you can just push it open and it comes open. Okay, so now let's go uh, walk around and see if we can find a good juniper tree to paint. Okay, the little trail starts right here. And... Uh, goes all the way around the uh, to the fence of the property back there and all the way around and then comes back out uh, up there kind of close to where the stop sign is there and then you know, walk back to the van. So, so I, what? you guys, why didn't you tell me I have paint on my face? Oh my God. Oh, well, I'll have to wait till I get back to the van to get that off. So 
So anyway, I'm going to take a few more pictures. I took some this morning, and uh, they're probably going to be better from this morning because the sun's kind of getting high in the sky. And it doesn't make for as good at photographs as the morning sun. I can't believe you guys didn't tell me I had paint on my face. Okay, we'll see you back at the painting station. I bet you guys wouldn't tell me if I had spinach in my teeth either, would you? Did I get it? Yeah, close enough. Okay, so let me show you the photographs that I took this morning because I took one photograph a little while ago and it, this, the sun's just too high in the sky. So um, I'll show you what I took this morning and I'll tell you which one I decided to paint. but I finally got my awning replaced. And this is the first day that it hasn't been too windy to put it out. I had coffee out here this morning and I'm getting ready to set up my little studio outside and I'm gonna paint that juniper tree. So see you in a minute. I do not really have the equipment to photograph me painting. <laughs> My tripod keeps going Aww. So I'll just kind of show you what I'm doing, just starting out. I'm just kind of marking the branches here.
the wind kicked up and my awning retracted. <laughs> so I can't really paint anymore because the sun is too bright and my paint is drying out too quickly. So I will have to finish this painting another day, probably inside. And I will show you how it comes out uh, whenever I get it finished.